Mingo still trying to go up on that chain. Oh. Finally does, and they score! <laughs> Dejan Mingo, his second! Playing professional hockey wasn't even in the mindset of Dejan Mingo when he was a kid. In fact, it was a different sport altogether that he had his heart set on. I was a figure skater from five to seven years old. And who introduced you to that? My uncle introduced me and then my sisters were doing it. So they're already skating and I just wanted to get into it at five, so. So he did, but it didn't take long before he saw a pair of hockey skates and he was sold. My uh, neighbor was right next to us, so he had hockey skates. And I've never seen hockey skates before. And I asked my parents what are the difference between figure skates and hockey. And they explained to me and I wanted to do hockey right away. But it wasn't an easy transition. Skating wise, it was pretty hard because the figure skates are more flat. So I was falling all over the place with hockey. But after that, maybe a week it took me to get used to my hockey skates. But I couldn't shoot at the time, so that was, that was hard. Something Mingo overcame with a lot of hard work. In fact, his skills earned him a spot on the BGSU hockey team. Smart little shot here from the point. There you see Mingo just shoot that almost like a hard pass. And his versatility etched his name on the roster for the Toledo Walleye. As it's picked up by Mingo. Right circle, a wrist shot, and Ryder makes that save and holds on. This transition, a little easier to handle for the speedy skater. I played forward my first two years at BG, and then I transitioned to defense my junior and senior year. So that actually helped me out coming here because he has me switching on and off, so that really helped me out. And even though Mingo plays in a sport that doesn't showcase very many minority athletes, he says he hasn't faced much adversity surrounding the color of his skin. Not too much. My, my family always talks about it because they say, you know, it's a white man's sport, but I still love it. I love the game. I still go out and play my heart out, period. I'm actually pretty surprised there's no racism about it towards me during the game. So I haven't had any problems with, with that at all either. But when things do get tough, there's always one person Dejan knows he can turn to. I usually talk to my uncle. I talk to him about what's going on if I'm having a bad day or anything like that. What's the best piece of advice he's ever given you? Just play the game and keep a smile on your face. Something the walleye rookie encourages anyone who's working towards their dream to do. Just keep playing. If you're having a bad day, just keep a smile on your face. Not a lot of bad things happen to minorities. Some You see some in the NHL and a lot of black kids are starting to play hockey too. So just keep up the hard work.